One, two, okay. Sorry for that delay. We are going to try now to demonstrate how to get the home biogas system into alt space VR. And let's take a look at this. So I've got this Unity world open, this Unity environment, and it's uh, it's got some cool stuff in it that I've begun to bring in. But I'm going to go to zero 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 just to be in the place where I do my workshopping for my kits. And, um, oh, that's the IBC tanks. Yikes. Okay. <clears throat> so we'll set that in a second. Let me just bring the home biogas system in, first of all. So I'm going to go to my project, and I'm going to go to my Solar Cities IBC digester parts. And let me make a new folder in here. So I'm going to go to create. Is there a create folder anywhere? Add mesh where's the folder create folder there we go and let's see where did it show up it didn't show up anywhere oh it showed up inside assets i didn't want that so now there should be a folder in here new folder okay i'm going to call this home biogas and in that folder <coughs> I'm going to import a new asset, and that asset is going to be in Blender Models, and it is going to be Home Biogas. And there it is. And I'm going to drop it onto the screen, hit F to zoom in on it. Okay, so I have the Home Biogas unit there, which is looking fine. And I'm going to transform its position to 0, 0, 0. And then I'm going to focus in on it with F. There it is at 000. Here the IBC tanks. It's looking a bit big. <coughs> so <coughs> it'll come into the world super big, but that's all right. I just want to make sure. No, see, the scales are not commensurate. Scales are one except this, and that's going to create a problem. So I guess I can't use that. I have to delete it, and I have to open up Blender. Because I've noticed that Alt Space really messes things up if you don't have um, if you don't have everything as a scale of one. So let's get this scene here and call it Blender. I'm working in OBS Studio now. <clears throat> Do I have to add a source, which is window capture, and then say Blender, and <coughs> <coughs> yeah, Blender, 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 what's up with that, Blender, okay, so we have that, and now Move that up here, and let's see if yeah, Blender comes up. Although, why is it not? To look at Blender and see what it's doing wrong. There we go. That took a little while. All right, sorry about that. Okay, so we're now in Blender. And I just want to make sure that my OBS Studio is up. 
And so here, if I get rid of everything and I open up or import this FBX, which would be in which folder? Blender models. And then home biogas should be in here. And there it is. All right, there it is. <clears throat> now we do want to make it a bit smaller, but here's the thing. It's made up of different parts, as you can see over here. And that's not helpful. Uh, I do want it to be about the size of an IBC tank. So let me bring in an IBC just for reference. But let me also join all this up with control J. It'll let me do control J. Why it's not letting me? J, it's not letting me. These parts here, that joined up. That part and that part. Control J, join that up. Join that to here. I think now we have a coherent piece. Yeah, one piece, which should be called home biogas. <coughs> now let's bring in, oh, and then make the, uh, that origin, set the origin to the geometry so that when we rotate it, it's rotating around the center of it. All right. So now, as I said, we want to bring in a reference point, which would be bring in another FBX, bring in the floating gas holder. That'll give us at least a sense. Yeah. All right, so that's the size of that. And so this has got to be, it's also about a cubic meter. So when we look at the size of these together, period go in, should be a bit bigger. Still too big. Not a cubic meter there. All right. That's not terrible. Mm. <clears throat> Maybe a slightly bit bigger. Okay. That'll work. <coughs> All right, so now that I have this in here, let me save this so I can work on it later on if I need to, and I'll call this home biogas. I made this from scratch in another file, but uh, now I can go file and export, and export as an FBX again, and this time I can... Oh, did I do it? I didn't do it, so hit Control a and change scale so that the scale comes out as one for everything. Like you see how this, this is terrible because it went down to 0 0.010. Not that I'm exporting this, but when you hit scale for something, it changes to one. That's what you want to do. You want to make sure that the scale is one. And if it's not, you hit control A and you apply the scale. And then that scale applies. Now that you have it scaled as one, which is very important for alt space, then go to export FBX and we'll say home biogas. And this will be scaled one dot FBX. So I know which one this is. And Make sure that you're doing just the selected objects up here. Limit to that. Scale is one. And there we go. So now we can leave Blender behind and we can go over to Unity. Oops, if Unity will come up. There we go. So now we're back in Unity and we're now going to I'm in here. I'm just having a little trouble with OBS Studio. Okay. 
I'm going to come in here and import, re-import, no, I'm going to import a new asset. It's home biogas scaled. Now drag this in. And it looks pretty good relative to the other tanks. It works. All right. So we have our home biogas thing here, and it's quite near zero, zero, zero. I'm putting it actually at zero, zero, zero. And then I'm going to come in on this, and here's how I'm going to bring it into alt space as a kit item. I'm going to duplicate it, so I have a copy. That's control D. So I have a copy here in world. If I want to mess with it in there. But I take this one that's at zero, zero, zero. Let me make my rotation zero, zero, zero. No, that does not look good at all. Uh, let me try local. No, global, local, I guess I need to rotate it on the x-axis. That's really weird that it came in at that. Like, why is that? That's weird. Okay, it's got to be what it is. 547, huh? Let's check it out. Oh, it's even messed up that way. That's in the Z. Mm -hmm. Okay. Bizarre. All right. <clears throat> also, what's with the scale? The scale's supposed to be one. Okay, that is really bizarre. Oopsie. Nope. Home biogas scaled. There it is, scaled at one, but it's really super tiny. <coughs> so I don't understand that at all. Because I was pretty sure... Let me delete that out of here. What is this one here? This home biogas scaled. There's home biogas scaled one. I thought that when we bring this in... It would be a scale of one. So I'm confused. I gotta go back to gotta go back to Blender. I have not seen this problem before. Mm hmm. Home biogas. Scaled at one. Rotation, we should also make, let's change the rotation of this by hitting Control A again and going to Rotation, which then is set at zero. And then the location, let's set, so maybe that's going to help some. Everything is set. Uh, the mode is Euler, so that shouldn't matter. And... We go to export and we go to FBX and it's selected object and we're saying use space transform. I guess I can apply the transform. What does that do? It says bake space transform into object data. Avoids getting unwanted rotations to objects when target space is not aligned with blender space. Okay. And the armature Yep. All right. That's uh, it's supposed to do it. I'm gonna make this scaled too, just so I know that it's a different, different one. 
and now come to here and import this second one. So we have two. Drop it in. And fortunately, it seems like this one came in okay. Although the origin point is really off. And I don't understand that. Huh. Let's try this again. Get rid of it. <clears throat> Let's go back to Blender. And see where the origin is. Set origin to geometry. Ah, so now the origin, boom, is smack in the middle. That should help. The origin was not in the middle, and that really messed things up. So let's now go redo it, but I'm going to do it as number two and just overwrite it. Now come in, import the asset, and there it is. Now, yes, the origin is where we want it to be, and it scaled at one. Ooh, that was better. All right, so we're going to move that and, oops, we're going to duplicate that so we have a copy. But this one here, I'm going to set to zero, 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 and then find it. There it is. Okay, that's set to zero, zero, zero. And it's all looking good for me for now. So having that one there, <coughs> which is going to be called <coughs> Biogas Scaled for Alt-VR. And I take this, and now I go to Alt-VR. Notice that I'm using Unity 2019.4.2 F1, which is the only version of Unity that will work with this. So, oops, I, I didn't... Ah. I didn't even show you this. Sorry, OBS Studio's problem. Um, so I have this set zero, zero, scale is one. And what I'm gonna do now, the procedure that I'm gonna do is I'm going to take in Unity 2019.4.2 F1 <clears throat> I'm going to go to Alt Space VR, Build Settings. That calls this up here. I'm going to go to Kit. I am going to load kits. <coughs> I'm going to make a kit folder name here, which is going to be called Home Biogas. And the kit asset name is going to be HB2, because this is version 2.0. I can say 2.0, I suppose, if I want. Home Biogas 2.0. And now convert it to a kit prefab. It says it was created, and where it's created is down in a folder called Home Biogas under Prefab. So there's my Prefabs folder that was created by Alt Space, and that's the Home Biogas, and there it is, and you can see if I bring it in, it now has a collision mesh around it in green, and you have to make sure that that mesh is on the object. Sometimes it's not and you get really wacky results if it's not. So make sure that that is is on there. That green thing there. And I guess if you move this whole thing around then the position changes. I'm going to take this one and move it over. Take this one to there. But it doesn't matter because that should be baked into this. Yeah. This is baked into position 0, 0, rotation 0, 0, and scale 1.1. All right. So that's in this folder called Home Biogas under Prefabs. Now you go into Alt Space plugin and you go and you load your kits and find the one that you want. I'm going to put Biodigesters, select that kit. That's a kit over in Alt Space load the prefab directory. It's this directory over here to see all of them. And I've got animation, solar cities materials, home biogas and test folder. I'm going to be loading from the home biogas folder. That's this one here under prefabs. It's a prefab directory. And I'm uploading to an existing kit called biodigesters that I have in alt space from that home biogas. And I hit build and upload. And then you wait. And the first thing it does is it uh, 
starts compiling it, and then it's going to handshake with Altspace once it's compiled it. It's bundling and compressing the data. Now it's handshaking. I don't know if you can see that screen, if that came up. So now, <coughs> we go to OBS Studio because we're going to leave this and we're going to go to Chrome. And let me transition over to Chrome. And let me go to the... Okay, so I'm going to now go to or and go to kits. And somewhere in here I have a biodigesters kit. And when I open it, you can see that one minute ago, if you look over here, one minute ago I uploaded 0.2 megabytes into Android and PC using Unity 2019.4. I'm not sure why 2019.2. Oh, a year ago I was experimenting with 2019.2. That's why these other assets don't work. The Windmill and the other Biogas stuff, because they were uploaded with another version of Unity. So I'm going to have to re upload those. But there's the home Biogas system there. <clears throat> it's in there as an artifact. The other artifacts, like the dance floor, <coughs> you know, I just have to delete a lot of this stuff because it's not any longer relevant. I'm not even sure what some of these things were or are. Um, but Biodigester is there. So now when I go to the Rosebud Continuum and I'm going to enter the Rosebud Continuum, I should have access to it. So open Alt Space VR. Now I have to show you that. So I need to open uh, this. I need to go scene 5. This is in OBS Studio. One second. And this will be Alt Space or Alt VR. Say OK. And add to that the window capture for Alt VR. Hold on. And we are there. Almost there. Automatic Windows capture. Alright, so boom, let's another second I'm almost ready for this I need to add my camera video capture device <clears throat> and there we go okay transition all right so we're here in alt space hold on let me make my camera just a little bit a little bit smaller not block anything all right, so we're in there, and let me fly. It's a toggle flight, and let me go up in the air, over past the dragon, out of just the dragon. And past the solar panels there house and go into the greenhouse. Alright, so inside the greenhouse, around here, after the aquaponics system, is where we have the biodigesters. So, I'm going to look in world editor. Go to mine, go to kits, go to biodigesters, and there's home biogas. There it is. It's there. It's looking a bit small. The rotation lock is on. So when I click on it, I find it here, go to the gear, I say home biogas 2.0. I can rotate it, but I'm not sure. Oh, there we go. I rotate it that way. All right. This has got to be zero. This has got to be zero. This should be 270. And the scale should be one. Confirm, and there it is. But, uh, 
What did it do? Yeah, it's because rotation lock is on, maybe? Let me see. Let's try this again. Now go to Z, zero, and then Y. I don't know what this should be. If this should be zero, maybe? Yeah, okay. Fair enough. Oh, except it's, no, it's the right way. All right, that's cool. Home biogas system is in the greenhouse. And I can lock it now, so it can't be manipulated. But it's in world, where it belongs. I also need to put in a pail or a bucket. So I'm gonna go to alt space, to kits, and I think in the campfire they have a bucket. Okay, so I'll bring that in and move this over and take the bucket that they have and march forward with it. Oh, didn't mean to bring a house in. Oops. Look at that cabin. Okay, so let's get this bucket in place. Under there. And then there's a um, there's an animation that I like to put of water. So when I go into featured and I go to kits and I go to effects, there's rain, which is over here, and I can bring that rain in. Except it's way too big. And scale it way down. Oops. It's not really letting me get at that rain, is it? I think I need to turn off flying, but I can't seem to do that unless I get rid of this, and then I can turn off flying, and then whoops, I fall on the ground. And then let me grab grab this bring it down. Looks like my bucket's too high, so I need to bring that down. It's, it says really hard to edit in PC versions, so I'll have to get into my Oculus Quest in order to do a good job with this. So the bucket for now, there's another bucket in this world. Lock that one, lock this one. There's that one locked. Although I should call this home bio, bucket home biogas. Okay. <clears throat> and it should be scaled. Seems a bit big for a bucket. Way too big. So maybe we don't want it to be that big. Or maybe it's the home biogas system that is too small. Nope, scale one. Hmm. Well, the bucket's definitely way too big. It seems like I can't grab the rain. So I'm going to have to go in and do that in, uh, do that in alt space VR. Because it's 
semester. This on the ground. Maybe I do need to make this bigger. We are just slightly getting there. All right. For now, we'll leave that, and then I'll fix this, as I said. So you could find the rain if you were looking, but you'd have to go and look for under R for rain. It's really a bad system here. There it is. <clears throat> so instead of calling this rain, I'll call this... Rain, um, um, biogas, slurry, and confirm that, and bring it down so it's coming out of there, and bring the bucket to capture it. But again, this is Last thing I'll put on this is a, a legend, put a buttons, and I'll put a question mark, and I won't move that. It's a really hard time doing it like this. Then we'll make when we click on it. This is um, button on biogas, and then the dialogue is going to be this is the commercial on biogas 2.0 system. It comes in a small box and inflates with water. Being assembled comes folded, let's say. Comes folded in a small box and can be assembled and inflated in less than two hours. It is basically a composed of two balloons pipes. The bottom balloon is filled with water and <coughs> Or some other starter culture 
of Anakin's. Your Oops. Okay. top balloon plates when the gas is produced. Every time you feed your food waste in one end, it produces good fertilizer in the other, from the other. Let's confirm that, and then let's stop editing. So when you click on that, yep, that's what's going to appear when you walk up to it. All right, so that's about all we're going to do for now. The little tweaking we're going to do. Um, I should try to put a stove in here. If there is one. Let's see. City props. Have a stove. Posters. Oh, you know what we can do? We can come over here. Oops, that was going on. Let's turn around there. And let's, let's go back and there's a pizza that we can bring in. I do need to lock this, don't I? Yep. Need to lock that. Okay. Grab this. We lock the pizza. Stove. It's too bad they don't have any way to search their props because it makes it a big pain. I don't see anything in here. Nope, that was a waste. It's not in city props. Yeah, I could really have to get to know. Those things. I mean, I can put fire here. It's not really where the fire is with comb biogas, but it indicates what is there. So, nature props, nature effects, prototype.
There's no stove. So I'll have to bring in my own stove, I guess. Town items, maybe. Air vent, air vent. Keep looking through, keep looking through. Art, bath, sink, barbecue. Okay, we can bring in a barbecue. And move this over. Bring the barbecue over here. And rotate it. Oh, the barbecue. It's a shame you can't duplicate from within the world either. That's a real pain. But there's the barbecue. And I have a feeling that our home biogas system is made way too small. Let's make this home biogas system 1.5. And let's move it. Let's unlock it, move it in local Z maybe. Yep. Let's move it in local Z. We're also going to have to move the food waste, but there's that, and then we can lock it in place there, can't get the water yet, the bucket is locked, we're going to get the food, and the fire is now going to be moved. hard to control that fire in here. Locked by collision. Stuck. Stuck, stuck, stuck. Fire is stuck. I guess I could need to unlock this and move this over. Finally. Right, let's, uh, that. And let's see. 
let's see about the pizza over here. biogas system and we can do our editing later on but that's the basic idea right there all right so you can build your worlds and put the stuff in that's in those worlds and then have all of your signage that you want in there and that sign there is going to come out. That's from a Unity file. Alright, so long for now.